Okay, you guys, we just touched down in our country number five, y'all. We are in Jordan, Oman. We're so excited. We're about to go get our bags. All right, you guys, we're in line, winding through these lines because we have purchased the Jordan Pass holder. So we're about to find more information about that. Hopefully I'll get the vlog more. Some of these countries don't like vlogging, y'all. Sorry. Okay, y'all, that was super easy. When you get your Jordan Pass, there is no other like fees you have to pay. You just get your visa, they verify it, and you just go through the process really fast. Okay, y'all, that was super easy. We got our fifth stamp. Shit, it's only been how many days? Eight, nine, nine days. Nine days and five stamps? 10 days, five stamps? I don't even know how many days, y'all. Don't even listen to me. Okay, y'all, super easy. That's our fifth stamp. We went through immigration. We went through the visa process. It only took like less than like, less than 10 minutes, about five minutes max. Now we're about to Well, you guys, we just got here. He's drinking all the water as usual. He never leaves me any water. He don't even ask me if I want it. I can't. But well, we just got here. I don't know what's going to do. 
21, 21. It's 21 to 21. So that's um, 9.21, y'all. Oh, yours is, he's just bumped his foot. Um, <clears throat> I had a big uh, meal at the airport. So I'm not quite hungry. I mean, I can snack on something, but I'm not quite hungry. Why did he tell me that there was the, um, a Mexican restaurant? I, like, he told me, like, our apartment was sitting on top of a Mexican restaurant, and it's not. Why would he tell me that? He's just the best on me the whole time. But I'm excited to be here in Jordan, Oman. Um, totally different world than um, Cairo. Way more developed. Did not expect that. I didn't know what to expect to be honest with you like I was telling you a car I'm very open-minded but I didn't know what to expect but I came prepared for everything so I came prepared for super modesty I came prepared for um, just me dressing myself being myself I came uh, prepared for areas that you know it's just not appropriate to be dressing up and just uh, stuff like I have on now for um, the flight but from what I understand from what I see, these people, they kind of um, dress up a little bit. So, you know, I'm not worried. I came with my A-game. So, anyway, we're going to figure out whether, oh, we have to get him some water. So, we're going to step out and run some errands and you guys can come with us. Hopefully, this place will be an easier place to um, vlog versus Egypt was not. It just was not. It was not the place. And then um, in Rome, we was there for 24 hours. So we would just go, 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 go. And it was hot and we were tired. So we didn't get a chance to really vlog. But I did manage to um, to record some stuff for you guys, for you guys to see. And hopefully I'll have some good informational stuff for you guys, especially for, for Egypt. If you guys are planning to go to Egypt, um, I'm quite sure my husband's going to put together an informational video with some facts and tips because that's the type of person he is. I'm just like going with the flow. I'm like, hey, look at us. Here we are. But, you know, he likes to do like informational facts stuff so you guys can get a little mixture of both. <clears throat> so, you ready? You ready for the shenanigans in our mind? You ready to see what our mind's about? Jordan, because I don't see a lot of black people going to Jordan Oman. I looked it up on YouTube. It was like nothing. Just a lot of men, not women. So I'm excited to be able to um, to do that for us. Okay, you guys. We are actually off of Rainbow Street, which is cool. That's like the that's like equivalent to their Vegas Strip, I guess. <laughs> Only right around a corner. Only right around a corner. So, we're gonna walk to some stores and see what's going on and check out the neighborhood. It's not as hot as it is in Egypt here, but I'm trying not to film where there's people for people's privacy. They're already like staring at me the way I'm dressed. And probably because I'm like, Black people all the time traveling to Jordan, you know? So it's probably not a racist thing, but more of a, oh my God, there's black people thing. I would like to know what they're saying. Maybe I should walk around with the translator. Like, like, they still on the hustle out here, though. Yeah. Exactly. I'm trying to give y'all the real, real. Walaikum salam. You gotta learn some languages so they can at least respect you. They don't expect black people to speak Arabic. 
they don't expect us to be cultured because it's based off of things that they see on social media and the news and stuff so <laughs> they're gonna run us over he keeps crossing in front of my uh, my view so y'all like I said I don't want nobody to take my phone or tell me to stop recording so I'm gonna put y'all away for a second and bring y'all back I think they're very beautiful people it's a very beautiful place y'all look at that they like the party They out here looking at what? Who is? Huh? <laughs> he was giving me a thumbs up. I flipped the camera down out of respect, but he didn't mind. Well, so that's what's up. I did. I was flipping it to me. I can see my lens is a little dirty, y'all. It's better. It wasn't dirty, it was just humid. It's real foggy. Oh, that's pretty. <laughs> Oh, not right now. Thank you. It's nice though. Oh, you will. Walaikum salam. He says shisha. They got shisha. Y'all still ain't telling me what shisha is. They tell me shisha is a drug. But what is shisha? I'm back. I'm gonna get all of it. All the excitement. Oh, thank you, not right now. I feel sad. You got it. It's stress facing. For sure. Now I can taste the um, Middle Eastern flavors in it. So maybe it's a fusion. I put some guacamole. It looks like sour cream and some salsa. There's mango in this. Look 
pretty good. It has cabbage instead of lettuce. It has um, lemon lime rice. I don't know if it said refried beans or just beans. I haven't got to that yet. And I think there's cheese in here, but I haven't tasted the cheese yet. I got the side of guacamole and salsa. That's what the guacamole looks like. This avocado onion. And I think this is cilantro. Alright. I'm going to finish this. Joseph's watching you too. Y'all, I have three suitcases full of clothes. Joseph just probably has this on one side. And I don't know what to wear. I didn't ex I didn't really plan um, this leg of what, what clothes to wear. Because I didn't know what to expect. But last night, I had on just a regular t-shirt with... Um, Biker shorts and all the women just kept staring and snickering at the guys and everything. So I was a little uncomfortable. But I don't have stuff that's big and baggy. I do, I do, but I don't know where that is. It's too pretty. Okay, you guys, I'm getting dressed. We did some research of why, um, like, <clears throat> when we got here, I had all those looks and snickers and stuff. It's because we found out that um, wearing shorts is considered provocative and sexual. And Joseph was like, I should keep my arms covered. I used to wear these, right? This. And um, I was like, oh, I can wear my sports bra if I get hot, you know. But he's like, no, cover up. <laughs> cover up, y'all. He said cover up. So I didn't bring a lot of stuff to cover up. But I think I'm going to wear these. I wanted to wear, um, like, some sandals, you guys, because I'm tired of wearing my tennis shoes. But if we're doing a lot of walking, you'll see my tennis shoes. I mean... It is what it is. I'm on vacation. I'm here to enjoy and to look good at the same time. Okay, you guys, this is the final look. This is me being modest. My shoes that I'm aware are from Shein. My sandals are from Shein. The outfit's from Shein. My sports bra is Victoria's Secrets. My glasses are Gucci. DR visor. DY bracelets. David Yarman. The perfume I have is, um, I forgot my sister gave it to me, it's the rose one. I'll tell y'all later if I remember, but this is the final look, y'all. Get into it. Camera on the environment, y'all had enough looking at me, but, um, we ran into a Waffle House, got me some coffee. I got a double shot of espresso and I added some water to it to top it off so that I can um, cool it down to drink it because it's hot. I don't want to get ice because I don't know if it's filtered. But I don't know if it's me, but I am like swallowing down all the double shots of espresso that I've been getting. I don't know if it's because it's not strong enough or I'm just needing that energy. <clears throat> but this is Amon, Jordan, the city. They sleep in the daytime because it's hot and they come alive at night like Egypt. I already can see the difference in culture. 
and the environment. Hence, we're walking the streets. We didn't walk the streets of Egypt. Look, they got a flag all the way out there. I don't know if you can see it. Big old Jordanian flag. I'm gonna save some of my batteries. So I'm just gonna pop y'all in and out when there's some good stuff to see. Follow the old guy, he, he got it right. Get in the shade. That was short, right? Another lady. Turn left onto Kerfon Street. They got, they got pictures. So I'm about to turn around and take the picture. Hopefully we can find umbrella while we're out. I'm covered up and they still looking at me. They don't get a chance to see black people. Real black people, black Americans. Those are pretty. That's pretty. Would he be like worried for my safety? Or like excited that I'm. He liked that I was a world traveler. Okay. We passed a mile already. Yeah.
Roman amphitheater. Romes were everywhere through this region. Columns. The Roman Amphitheater of Jordan. It's like going to the Colosseum. Just imagine how many speeches were given here. We just got cussed out by a Jordanian. He said, F our mothers, because <laughs> we wouldn't give him no money. Y'all, I don't care about him cussing me out. Joseph was like, I know what that means. I should have showed him the bird, like how we do it in the States, but <sighs> let him continue looking stupid and disrespectful. We got class, y'all. We got class. Oh. I told him, honey, that I lie. And he still cussed me out. <laughs> yeah. Our trip has been very physical. And I love it. I'm glad we prepared our bodies. All that exercising prepared us to see stuff like this. We was all the way over there where the Colosseum is. And now we're going all the way up there. We've already walked um, over a mile from where we are staying. But it's all been inclined. Yeah. Cynadel. Roman. Okay. Uh, amphitheater. Rooms were all through here. This whole city is built on hills. We trying to get up there. It's a test. Taking a break in the shade. Yes. Because maps is telling us that we need up those stairs. Break time. There's a lot of steps, but we just gotta get to that next break.
like better the chicken and garlic yeah. I had a meat lovers that was truly dark dark Jordanian and that's a sweet one apple fritters like an apple fritter A shopping night. Does a does a bread come with this? Oh, 